Hey everyone, I'm Jason O'Dell from Jason O'Dell Photography, and I just downloaded the latest version of Adobe Lightroom Classic. There was a huge update that went out today across the entire Creative Cloud platform, including Photoshop, Lightroom, Lightroom Classic, Camera Raw, everything. So I'm just upgraded to Lightroom version 12, which is the latest version, and I wanted to show you this great feature that they've added to the masking, which is um, the ability to mask um, not only just objects, but people. So I'm going to focus on people today because I think it's really cool. So let's jump into Lightroom and see what um, what they've added here for um, this new feature. All right, I'm in Lightroom now, and I'm in the Develop module, and I've gone into the Masking panel up here on the right-hand side. This is this little circle with the dots around it. And I just pulled up a picture of myself that I shot um, when I was uh, traveling in Croatia this past summer and um, thought it would, it would work for this. So when you first um, get the panel open, it will look to detect people and it'll take a few moments depending on how fast your computer is. But you pull this up and it detects a person and you click this. And this is what's great. When, you, when it detects a person in the shot and it can be more than one person, you can select multiple people in an image. You have not only the option to select the entire person, but you can do just the face or the body skin, or just say you want to select eyebrows, or the outside of the eye, the irises in the pupil. This is amazing. Lips, teeth, hair, I don't have much. But uh, you can do this. You can make it one mask, or you can even make it with separate masks. So let's just say, for example, I just wanted to do the, uh, the iris adjustment. I could, and then the, um, I would like to have a skin mask for a, a separate one. So I can create three separate masks for this. Click create. Now I've got three masks in the masking panel. So I can go over here, here's the eyes. Let's just enhance the, the eyes a little bit. Maybe we'll just use Adobe's eye enhance, um, the iris enhance uh, preset here. And find it. Here it is. Let's click that open. Let's open up the shadows a little bit. And then I can go to these other masks and I can do my skin adjustments. So let's take the face skin. Let's, let's dial down the uh, clarity and let's dial down the texture to smooth things out. Do it on the right mask. There we go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, make the same adjustments to the other mask. And so now when we take a look at the entire mask as a whole, if I toggle them off, you can see what I was able to do. So if you haven't already updated your version of Lightroom, go ahead and do that now because there's just a tremendous amount of stuff that you can do with these new selection tools. I think they're incredibly powerful. It's going to keep you out of Photoshop and you're really going to enjoy it. So until next time, I'm Jason O'Dell. Check me out at luminescentphoto.com and I'll see you soon.